Welcome to Chromebook Classroom. James here. Today we're going to be talking about moving around the classroom with Chromebooks, like physically holding the Chromebooks and how you should move around the room with them and not. Our good friend Mauricio is going to show us how to carry a Chromebook. Here he's carrying a Chromebook like a dog begging for a treat. That is not how you carry a Chromebook. Now the way he's carrying it here will more likely get him to the principal's office rather than his desk. In his third attempt, he's opened his Chromebook before he's arrived at his work table. If he was trying to impress me by showing me how excited I was to work in my class, it didn't work. Thankfully, it looks like the fourth time was a charm, because here, Mauricio firmly has two hands underneath the Chromebook with his thumbs on top and ready to move about the classroom. Nice work, Mauricio. Two hands firmly on a closed Chromebook is definitely teacher approved. It's important that you realize that you and what you do on the internet has the power to change the world. Barack Obama's creative use of the internet helped him get elected President of the United States. The people of Egypt use the internet to help get the message out that they were unhappy with their government. And if it wasn't for the internet, I probably wouldn't have to ever listen to this guy. So it's not just a computer, it's a powerful tool. A tool for creation, whether it's writing, singing, academic, artistic, or even teaching someone how to dug you. So treat your Chromebook with the respect that it deserves. And always remember to use two hands.